Thank you once again for joining me here with this next lesson here on our journey towards learning how to play the saxophone. Now, what I wanted to do just quickly in this lesson is talk about neck straps. Neck straps are important because quite simply, they hold up your ax, they hold up your saxophone. Without a neck strap, your right thumb will very, very quickly fall off. Uh, and quite simply with a tenor saxophone, you probably won't be able to keep hold it up. It's, it's that simple. So neck straps are important. So the first thing that you want to do with your neck strap is, if you can, if you have a collar, put your neck strap behind your collar. So your collar goes between the neck strap and your actual neck. So put the neck strap behind the collar, put your collar underneath the neck strap. The second thing that you want is, if possible, you want a big neck strap see this bit here the it's kind of made of wetsuit material on mine i like it there are others some of them are fluffy some of them are big and fat like a guitar strap but you know this one i like it, it does it for me so if you can get a big fat bit at the back the third thing that you want with a neck strap is you actually want the clip so on my neck strap here there's an actual there's a clip here this clip, what it does when you hook it on to the, the little neck strap oh, holy thing on your saxophone, once the clip's on, it doesn't come off. So if you accidentally drop it or your finger, you slip, the neck strap, you drop your sax, it's not going to fall onto the ground and break. Now, there are some other neck straps, and here's one, I've, here's another of my neck straps that I've got. This one here, it just has a hook. So you can see the hook just here. So that's okay, that holds the, next, the saxophone up, but it's not ideal because if you're moving around, you can actually drop, the, 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 the saxophone can actually fall off. With the hook, with the clip here, it's not gonna fall off. So there's that thing. The third, fourth, is that the fourth thing? Don't know, the next thing on our next strap list is the correct height. So what you want to do, once you have connected your neck strap, your right thumb goes underneath the little thumb rest here on the, towards the bottom of the saxophone. Your left thumb goes uh, here on the, it's usually a black, sometimes it's white, up towards the top. So the neck strap itself takes all the weight. You can, you know, it's just not a problem. Your saxophone is not going to fall. So the neck strap is holding it up. But you want to get the adjustment, the height at the right, you need to adjust it so the saxophone is the right height. And obviously that's different for different people and different sizes and different size bodies. Okay, so what you want to do is just let the, neck, the saxophone hang and you need to be able to just pivot it. You're not picking it up. You're not letting, the neck strap is holding the weight. You want to pivot on the with the hook on your neck strap you want to pivot your saxophone carefully so it goes right into the middle of your mouth you don't have to lean down you don't have to lean up you just right pivoting it goes into your mouth naturally at the right height so i've got mine here at the right height for example i'll lower it so it's too low pivoting i would have to bend down and that's wrong pulling it up Getting it to the right height, almost, that is the right height. And that is our talk about neck straps. I will see you in the next lesson. Thank you.